everyone, welcome back to my channel. I guess I wanted to film this video real quick, just as you can tell from the title, to give you all some updates about what is going on in my life. But I do wanna just start out by saying Happy New Year. I hope that you all are having an absolutely wonderful start to 2024. All right, so let's just get into it. I am 99% sure that I am getting surgery in two days. As long as my insurance approves of everything on time and whatnot, then I will be getting knee surgery in two days. I tore my meniscus in my right knee. I will put a picture from my MRI up here and as you can tell where I circle that little triangle that's where my meniscus is and obviously it's supposed to just be completely dark there but you see that white line going through it. That is the tear in my meniscus. I did this at the gym. I was doing a cable kickback exercise which is not something at all that you would think that could have torn my meniscus and literally as soon as I did the exercise my knee immediately felt funny like I knew something was wrong and in my head I was like I just tore my meniscus like I knew it and I knew it because I've actually had two knee surgeries on my left knee before I was talking to my doctor about it and he was saying that honestly my right meniscus this could have been an injury that has just been barely hanging on by a thread for years and then from gymnastics from my job as a flight attendant all of the movement and how active I am as a person it really could have just been from anything and so he was like yep you just did one little thing that tweaked it and just tore it this is a surgery that I absolutely need to get done the meniscus is not something that just repairs itself on its own I am disappointed Obviously, this is not how I wanted to start off my year, but I'm trying to remain really positive and hopeful and just remember that it's gonna be okay. Like, at the end of the day, this is a really minor surgery. It's not that intense. With that said, though, I was talking to my doctor and he has estimated that I'll need about four to five weeks post-surgery to recover and be well enough to go back to work and fly. So, obviously, I will be needing to take some time off of work and I will not be flying over let's just say the next month-ish. With that said, I will be taking a break from this channel, my Jed and Julia channel, and with my downtime, I obviously will have a lot of time to read, so I'm going to be focusing over this next month or two on my Julia Jean channel specifically, on my Julia Jean channel specifically. So on that channel, I will be uploading not only a lot of book content, but just a lot of overall lifestyle content as well. So it would mean a lot to me if you guys would go click on that channel, subscribe, and hang out with me over there over the next month or two so you guys can keep up with everything I have going on. One last update before I start to close things out. I will still be very active on the Fable app where I have my online book club and for the month of January we voted to read the book Powerless. So I will put a link in my pinned comment and video description box below if you would like to join my virtual book club. So yeah, that is pretty much all I got. I hope that I'll see you guys over on my Julia Jean channel. But anyway, thank you so much for watching today's video and I'll see you next time. Bye!